fantastic news. We can do it. We can hack the new combined Etsy ad system to turn off Google Shopping ads. Hey, I'm Pam Duthie and I have been running an Etsy shop for 11 years now. So I share videos with you with the tricks, tips, advice and the news announcements to help you keep your Etsy shop running as best as you possibly can. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, don't forget to click subscribe and come back often. So if for some bizarre reason you haven't heard of the new Etsy ads, I have an entire playlist up above of what Etsy's doing, but they've been rolling out a new combined ad system. They were taking your promoted listing ads and your Google shopping ads and combining them all into one with far less functionality than we used to have. And one of the biggest complaints and fears that people like me were having was promoted listings had been a fantastic advertising platform. It had given a great return on investment, but Google Shopping ads were rubbish. Most of us did not want to use Google Shopping ads. And this new system was not giving you a way to just choose promoted listings and turn off Google Shopping ads. However, there is actually a sneaky little way that we can do this. And I heard about this and the other little stats tip that I'm going to share at the end. I heard about this in Iran Facebook group where there's over 10,000 knowledgeable people sharing these little secret tips. So if you haven't already joined up there, I'll leave a link down in the comments below. So when I heard about this, I literally did not believe it. There is a way to turn off Google Shopping ads. Where? How? I've looked everywhere. It's just not possible. But it is, and I'd already turned them off without knowing it. So if you go to your stats, drill down into see more data and then advertising, when you hover over each of the days on the bar, there's a little note of things that happened that day. And something I had totally missed when I turned on the new Etsy combined ads, immediately when I hover over that day, it says Google Shopping ads turned off. Wait. What? So I'd been running promoted listings and Google shopping ads, mainly just about to share with you how terrible they were. But when I used the combined ads, this thing that was supposed to combine them all into one ad that we have no control over, it automatically turned off the Google shopping ads. This is very bizarre. And then in the E-Rank Facebook group, somebody said there is a magic trick to this. It is super simple. If your daily ad budget is below $4, they turn off Google Shopping ads. So let me just do this live to show you. If I hover over today's date, there is no announcement about Google Shopping ads. But if I go into my advertising dashboard, I change my daily budget to $4 and now back into stats. Look at what's happened. It is telling us that the Google Shopping ads are now turned on. Now, let's get back into my advertising dashboard, change my budget to $3.99, get back into my stats, and would you believe that? Google Shopping ads are turned off. How absolutely awesome is this? Now, I know this won't suit everyone. If you've had a much higher advertising budget in the past, if your ad spend has been much higher than this $4, then yeah, this won't help you at all. But for the littler guys, if you were just wanting to do promoted listings and your ad spend was under $4, you don't need to worry. Google Shopping ads aren't running. Now, I don't know if this was a deliberate feature, a glitch, something Etsy are keeping secret from us, but it's working just now. So don't be afraid to try a low budget on your Etsy combined ads. And then another quick thing I want to share with you. Someone shared this link, which is fantastically useful. I didn't even know it existed before, but it tells me the promoted listing data for all the keywords in my entire shop rather than just individual listings at a time so I can look at all the data from my entire shop. Again, I'll leave the link in the comments. This takes you to this page. I don't know why I never knew about it before, but it's still working if you're using the combined ads. This takes you to the secret page. So click on it and have a nosy about as well. It's super helpful to get this data to know what keywords are working when they're being shown in your shop. These high click-through 
rate ones are super important. And if it's a keyword that you hadn't quite thought of, you're not quite optimised for, you could bung that keyword in a couple of your tags and see how it goes. So have you spotted any secret little hidden ways to hack the Etsy combined ads? Share them in the comments below. Let us know what you're up to. Let us figure out how to do these ads as efficiently as we possibly can. And don't forget, if you want to be kept up to date with Etsy, click on my wee face to subscribe and come back often for more videos. Thank you so much. See you next time.